I look gorgeous this morning. Again, please don't ever be jealous of me. No. I just woke up a little while ago and um, we're supposed to get that storm today. But I wanted to get the camera on to show you the playroom. Alex, he's really enjoying himself this morning. <laughs> with this upcoming blizzard and people just heed the warnings and stay home. Our storm has already started across places like Kentucky, also in North Carolina and in Virginia. Another concern with the storm is Florida. We have a threat for tornadoes and damaging winds today. Some of this stuff is developed in the warm sector of the storm. Ice, about a half inch and even greater amounts are He's pulling all of the places like South Carolina, North Carolina, even farther north across northern Kentucky. So that's going to be something to watch out for. Very dangerous traveling conditions, travel not recommended, and anywhere from Arkansas to parts of the Northeast, you do have He's just been in here playing with himself with all of his toys for the longest time. So, so they're talking about the blizzard. We'll see how much we get. I'll do updates like I always do. afternoon now and I've got all my little chores done for the day and uh, I've got a little kitty by the door she's cold Ellie you're not going out because you just came in move go on back back come on just leave the cat alone <clears throat> it has gotten so cold outside the Sun came out this morning but um, it's obviously gone now and um, beginning to get dark in here so I'm already turning on my lights I got my lights on over the fireplace and right there and right there I'm gonna turn this on here in a minute I've made some Chex Mix I like Chex Mix when it's you know cold and snowy when whenever we get like blizzards and stuff forecasted that's the one thing I make I find Chex Mix to be a comforting food and I've got to pull in a bag of um, pellets here. I just threw a bag away. I stocked up yesterday, stocking it all the way up here so we would be ready for all of this weekend. So let me grab a bag and I need two hands because it's 40 pounds. I know. So this thing here of my pergola, I'm expecting that to come down with this blizzard because by the time snow waits on it and we're supposed to have very high winds <coughs> um yeah i'm expecting that thing to just come tumbling down but that's okay because we're replacing all that in the spring so we'll see what happens okay it was um about 8 30 ish or something like that i showed you we had um two inches of snow I'm letting the dogs out and um, it's a few minutes after midnight and we've got that much and now the wind's really blowing. So this is three hours later, you can see there, oh boy, we have out here probably, hmm, I don't know. Looks like we have about seven inches of snow. 
Go on. Go on, Lucy. It's just snow. Go on. Yeah, all that's going to have to be shoveled. Lucy. Lucy, just go on outside. It's okay. Still coming down. Doggies coming in. Snow falling. Wind howling. Can you hear it? So, it's um, 3.30 outside. Or 3.30 a.m. I had to go outside and shovel a nice pathway for the dogs to get out to the yard so they could go to the bathroom. And the weather is very severe, as you can see. It's still supposed to snow all day today. It's supposed to snow all night. And it's supposed to stop snowing sometime uh, Sunday morning. So, I don't know how deep the snow is going to get, but I would say it is about seven pushing eight inches of snow right now. Uh, it started snowing at six o'clock last night, but it was coming down a little bit, you know, it's just the beginning of the storm coming. And um, now it's like really here and dumping, and the wind's already kicked up too. So, um, <clears throat> I don't know. I think probably in a couple more hours I'm going to have to go back out and reshovel my pathway <laughs> over there. So I'm not doing the whole porch. Um, usually I get out there and I shovel the whole deck off, but then it's just, it's just too much to do it. Um, especially right now when I'm supposed to be sleeping. But the dogs had to go outside. So I went to put them out and they wouldn't go out because the snow was too deep and they didn't want to walk in it. So I had to go put on all my snow stuff and go get the shovel and um, go do all of that. So anyway, fun times and more fun times are ahead. But that's what happens when snowstorms come and we just deal with it, right?